In 1967, Gary Robertson and Terry Creighton, two high school caking buddies, became intrigued by stories about Binkley Cave, first explored in the 1920s. Along with students from Purdue University, they formed the Indiana Speleological Survey to map the cave. Physical effort was grueling with trips of up to 20 hours in the 52 degree cave water. Often constrictions and breakdown blocked their way, but their perseverance eventually paved the way for what you will see today. In early 2010, while exploring deep in the cave, two younger ISS cavers spied a small opening high up a waterfall dome. To reach the opening, they constructed a three-story scaling pole. After several arduous trips dragging the heavy pole section through the cave, they climbed the symbol pole up into the opening. At first, the passage appeared to go nowhere. As a last hope, they boosted one of the explorers into an opening in the ceiling. We have canyon. They had found a virgin borehole, a passage that has never been explored. The excitement of this discovery reinvigorated their wet, weary body. They had reached Big Bone Mountain, an underground peak formed by layers of rock that had fallen thousands of years ago. This discovery was four hours from the entrance, and they needed to find a shorter route. By May 2011, the search for a shortcut led them to a nearby cave that allowed them to map nearly a mile of new passages. The team pushed on through low water crawls and breakdown, and ultimately their dedication paid off when they unexpectedly discovered a connection to Binkley's cave.